Happy Wednesday, everybody. Uh, if you're like me, you got a little more time on your hands because of this quarantine business with the COVID-19. So I'm, uh, I'm gonna start a list of videos for you guys. Hopefully, if you'd like to follow, try out some different things, uh, and maybe after all this is said and done, you can try out and sign up for this. Today's workout is gonna be mostly an upper body workout. Uh, like I said, minimalist. We've got nothing but a set of kettlebells, one dumbbell, a jump rope, some suspension straps, and a resistance ball as well. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and jump into the warm-up. I will post all the uh, activities from the workout at the bottom. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. First thing we have is 16 squats, and then we're gonna go with 16 presses on the bands. If you're new to kettlebells, this, these videos will be a great tutorial for you to jump in and see if you really like to try them out. Uh, we'll try a bunch of different moves as these videos go along. Uh, like I said, if you have any questions about this, feel free to uh, drop me a line or reach out to our Facebook or, or our uh, website. Okay, we're gonna drive one bell and we've got 20 swings here. When you guys get your swings, make sure we're not squatting, that we're hinging from the hips. Shift, pop. set in with the kettlebells we're gonna go push up jump forward to a row here push up jump wide chin up stay low row row we have eight of these make sure chin is up we're not rolling our, our back I want to know what they do and how they do it, but most important, I want to know why they have an unwavering conviction to do what they do. I always do what I can. I can do it myself. Let's just do it. Don't half-ass it. Do it. Stop talking. Jump rope for us for 40 here. If you're an adult, don't be afraid to pick the jump rope back up. It's very much like riding a bike, just a little practice. Okay. We're gonna grab our suspension straps, facing. Make sure we got a straight body, straight back. And we're gonna curl the forehead for 12. Sit on our butt, get a little bit of core work in. We have our ball. Just turn, touch, touch. 12 aside. Keep your feet on the ground for me, please.
We're gonna grab our one dumbbell here. Have a sit. Concentration curl for 12. Make sure we get a full extension. Chest is up. We're gonna get a swinging shrug in. This is much of a dance, so don't be so rigid. Like a clock, tick tock. Shift forward, shrug on the back. Shrug. 16, guys. A little bend in the knees, get that rhythm. Tricep extensions. 16. Good, good. All right, guys. Hope we're all feeling warm. I am. I'm going to switch it over and do a little bit of what we call filler here. Just going to do a little bit of isolated leg work. We're going to do some reverse lunges with some twists to get the core working, get a little leg. Just rotate. 10 to one side. Let's grab our kettlebell again. 
we're gonna burn our shoulders a little bit more and add some tri excuse me, add some hamstring and core in. We're gonna go a deadlift to a high pull. So if you see from a side angle, hinge at the hips, a little bend in the knees, chin up, breathe out on the up. Twelve of them. Get a little more core work in here. Grab our ball. We're gonna go knees bent, feet on the ground. We're gonna go through a full crunch through the ball. It's gonna go above and behind the head as we do this. For 12, guys. Push press on the outside. This is not appropriate. Get your wrist locked. If you're new to kettlebells, this is going to feel slightly not good for a little while. You'll be okay. Get over it as we go up. This is our line of symmetry. We're going to keep it as close as possible. Roll and lock out. Think about jumping. guys take your time get them right Six. 
take a step back. Six. Good, good. Okay. I'm going to do chin ups. If you cannot do chin ups, we're going to take our straps, raise them up. Get them about waist high. For the filler, if you do not want to do chin ups, we'll take a step back. You have eight narrow palms facing rows, keep your body straight, and then palms down, elbows going out, eight. Hope everybody's feeling good. I got a nice little burn going on. Our next round with the kettlebells is going to go push up to a clean. This is not necessarily a beginner move. So if you don't feel comfortable with it, we can definitely do something different. Go to a push up to a row again or possibly a push up to a deadlift again. The push up to a clean starts much like the other ones. Wide stance, chin up, wide, swing back, pop, eight of them. Make sure we're using our backside and not just swinging. Get some power from your backside. Get up. Good. If you like me, you need a little bit of filler. So we're going to use it. Take the time, do a few glute bridges, get our heart rate back down. 20 skull crushers. So we're gonna be seated on the ball, here, straight up, all the way through. There is 20, and we are done. Just under 21, just under 21 minutes, and we got a good workout in. 
Try it out. Let me know what you think. Have a great day. Or you can deliver for a million items.